Inoffensive. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All to say, these pictures are not protected by copyright, so if you see these beautiful selfies of Naruto on the internet, Wikimedia has full resolution versions. You are free to do with them as you like because they are part of the public domain. So this picture right here, this like checkerboard, wouldn't that be a great phone background, computer background? I agree. Okay, but that begs the question too, well, what about when robots make things? If artificial intelligence creates some pieces of art, is that gonna be protectable? TBD, y'all, that's where the law is going, and so we will start addressing that, but that is not currently on the table just yet, but it's gonna probably be a hot issue. So I'm gonna talk about some common misconceptions in copyright law. As I said, lots of people talk about this stuff, but don't actually know much about it. The first common misconception is that if you write, no copyright infringement intended, then you are immune to suit. Isn't that cool? All you have to do is write those four, like, short, they're actually pretty long, four long words, and then nobody can sue you, and you can post whatever you want, right? No. Oh, good, you guys are learning. Yeah, that is not actually right. All these people on YouTube say, no copyright infringement intended. Um, they are wrong. And you know how I know you're wrong. Everybody could just Google it. And I'm going to read this one out loud, because I think it is just so good. Urban Dictionary, thank you. The phrase makes no logical sense because it directly contradicts their action of uploading content which they aren't the copyright holder of. By analogy, according to people who use the phrase, someone should be able to shoot them in the head while yelling, no harm or murder, manslaughter intended, and then get away with it. <laughs> really, Google has your back that like, keeps going on and on and on for pages about like, guys, this really doesn't work, so don't do it. Cool. Next one. But I found it on the internet. Look at those baby animals. <laughs> so cute. They're on the internet, so they must be public domain, right? No. Right. Okay, so I could post anything of mine on the internet. Guess what? You still can't have it. It's still mine. It's still protected by copyright. So you cannot take all of those photos and then just use them for your own devices and sell them because they still happen to belong to somebody. So an anecdote on this point. Life of a copyright lawyer adventures in knowing too much. One day I was walking around DC. It was a beautiful, beautiful fall day. And I raised my phone to the sky and I took this beautiful picture of this gorgeous red foliage against the blue sky. It's pretty nice, right? A few days later it was raining, so I posted with the melodramatic caption. Today, therefore, they took <laughs> A few days later, I get a notification on Instagram. I've been tagged in a post. I'm like, that's interesting. Who's that? Huh, Embassy Row Hotel. That's interesting. Well, they gave me credit, I guess, but they didn't ask me for it. I just think it's kind of funny. Of all of the people in the District of Columbia, they took the photo of a United States copyright office lawyer. <laughs> And look, I wasn't personally offended or bothered by this, whatever. I have a public Instagram profile. Like, this is fine. If they'd asked, it would have been fine. But you know, I chose to take this as a bit of a teaching opportunity. <laughs> so I sent a message. I said, hey, thanks for the share. Always happy for my public photos to get more airtime. I just wanted to send a note because I'm a copyright lawyer. <laughs> And posting someone's photo with an Instagram, even with a credit, is technically copyright infringement. Um, I'm not mad at all. And please continue using it, but someone else down the line may be less happy and they'd be right. If you comment on the photo you want to ask for permission to share, that is legally sufficient and happy to answer any questions your team might have. Smiley face! <laughs> all right, guys. If you receive this message,